Well, good day. Thank you for joining me for another episode of Super Nintendo Gameplay. I should probably stop saying Nintendo because the big N is on a rampage against uh, people playing games on things they don't sell anymore. So anyway, um, we have a game here based on a comic book and cartoon that I quite enjoyed. There's been a bit of live action done over for it over the years. A couple of series, I think, if I'm, if I'm remembering right. Or no, one live action and maybe an animated series or two. I don't know. I remember mostly the original animated series as well as the comic book. So anyway, The Tick. There's Chairface Chippendale. Some hilarious villains. It was very much a tongue-in-cheek uh, comic. Eyebrows Mulligan. All the baddies. The forehead. Okay, can I skip all this? Can I can I do anything? Am I even in control? Um, my gamepad was disconnected briefly. I've been struggling with that. The cable isn't in good shape. Well, I shouldn't say that. It seems to come undone now from the top of the gamepad, so I might have to restart here. Uh, how do I set up the controls? Options, control reports, port one, joypad. Set the uh, ba -ba -da -ba -da, joypads, joypad one. Do I get to say what it is? Up is unset, really. Oh, okay. I don't imagine you can see that. Okay, I'm just quickly setting up the controls here. Start, select, uh, uh, remember the Super Nintendo controller, which was A and B. I think it's different than the Xbox. SNES controller. Probably I should have paused to do this. A, yeah, it is opposite of the Microsoft controller. So I lost my emulation window. I mean my play window. A, B, X, Y, left, right. Apply, okay. There we go. Now I should be able to go. Alrighty, the tick. Start game, test sounds. Like we just start the game. I don't. I don't know that I've ever seen this. The night of a night of a million zillion ninjas. Love it. Love it. Hilarious. Here we go. Press a button. Press a button. Yeah, big doughhead. There we are. Oh, it's a. It's like. Oh, did I just jump off the bus? I'm a genius. Can I crouch? Arthur, call Arthur. Okay, Arthur swoops in. Oh, I want to crouch. That's what I really want to do. Okay, I keep calling Arthur by accident. I got wasted all my Arthur calls. So, I'll just keep kicking these guys for now. Oh, I have to try to progress, obviously. Do I just keep fighting them on top of the bus? Probably, maybe, I don't know. What else can I do? I can I can punch. I'm the tick, I feel like I shouldn't be. I can jump. I believe I accidentally jumped myself right off the bus. Yeah, take that, you ninja. Is there a difference between kicking and punching? I do I get a better range with kicking? Level completed. Spoon! feels a little random, for Christ's sake. Oh, okay. Yeah. Greasy Heights. Oh, for Pete's sake. Right, look at me go, losing ticky, tick, ticky lives. Did you just do a pirouette in the air? <laughs> I 
Okay, so far my impressions of this are... It's a little on the weak side. Go. All right, back to the beat-em-up. We are. So the animation of the characters and the, like the bad guys, and the tick are clever enough. But the gameplay so far has been pretty shallow. And weak. No more calling Arthurs, because I blew all those by accident. next. Oh, hey, I got, got some help from the what's your Macaulay guy. I control both simultaneously. There's no finesse to this at all. Basically just swing away. I don't know if later on there might be, but uh, certainly not so far. None of these guys are really any harder than in any of the other ones either. The only thing I've seen that looks slightly dim more difficult is when the Oh, and my helper's gone. Is when the uh, samurai ninja type with the swords had the spinning swords, but not sure that I took any damage during that segment either. Nope. Nope, not that time. Oh, I did that time, okay. I mean, kicking seems to be as good as anything here. Oop, I, did I get hit? Jump. Where's punch? There it is. Weird, slightly weird places for the different controls. Whoa. Oh, where did that guy go? Hmm. Maybe there's some finesse involved in that. I'm not sure. certainly been hit a few times now. Those black suited guys take a couple of take, take a couple of uh, knockdowns to defeat. So there must be, maybe there's a better way to approach the uh, red guys. Maybe not. There certainly are a lot of baddies to mow through. shortage of bad guys. I guess that's inherent in the name, the night of a million billion, million zillion ninjas or whatever it was. Oh, punching is maybe faster. That's maybe where it comes in. Hmm. Hmm. 
Mmm. Damn it. Turn around, tick. Come on. <laughs> tweet, tweet. Okay, this is annoying now. As far as I can tell, you've just really got the two moves. And the jump, I guess, which I haven't been using. Maybe that plays into it a bit more? I don't know. Or can play into it a bit more? Let's see if I can do that with the... Nope, that didn't work. I tried to jump over and land on him when he was spinning his swords. Did not work. I feel like I beat up a million zillion ninjas here. Same. Oh, it's a 2D section here. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, for Pete's sake. Come on. Oops. Kind of seem... Ah, bugger. Kind of seems the same as the last time. Oops, son of a... Subplot, resistance is silly... Subplot? What? Oh, is it because I fell down? Oh, must be. Maybe not, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know, maybe it's because I fell down, I'm not sure. Ooh, that's a big old swing he's got there with his chainsaw. Wow, he doesn't... He, he's not easy to hit. You can just hit him once and then he, you can't hit him again. Chair face something, chair face wants... Poo. <laughs> Yikes, man. So this is some kind of battle. Okay. Okay. Subplot battle. Now what? Do I go back to the rooftops or do I have to, uh, or do I get to go on to the next? Oh, I go back to the rooftops. Oh, perfect. That's exactly what I was hoping was going to happen. Yep. Pirouettes. Well, that just feels frickin' annoying, is what that does. Oh, God. Good news. Will I die? Probably. Do I care? Not really. Continue. Okay, five. Oh, I get five continues. No kidding. Well, I'll see if I can get to the end of this level and see the. We'll see what the next section is like, anyway, and then. And then uh, that's probably going to be enough of this for me. Whoops. failing at dodging things, I won't get to the end of this section. Spoon! But of course I do. I even get to keep my score. How lovely. Oh, what the? <laughs> oh, for Pete's sake. Okay. Can I go up? No. I guess I'm just trying to stay away from the ninjas and avoid the spears and shit. Oops. Oh my god, this just... 
I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Jesus. Just feels, I don't know, cheap? Just feels cheap. That's kind of where I'm at on this one. Used to have a little tick figurine around here somewhere. I think I did finally get rid of it. Looks like another beat em up section. Whoops, jump like crazy. Same, same bad guys. Yep. We're not in the night of a million zillion ninjas anymore, though. Are we? Maybe we still are. I don't know. Same baddies, slightly different level concepts, but the, or level, uh, you know, with the tightrope and stuff, but just felt in the roof, the rooftop stuff. Just feels, I don't know, simple, simplistic, and weak. I'm being harsh on the tick here, but that is my honest opinion at this point. Not much depth here. Just basically a, a marketing tie in sort of a game that was probably very quickly developed, I'm gonna guess. I mean, it, it's nice looking, but that's about it. You know, it probably ticks a lot of the marketing boxes. Good, good looking levels, nice animations. Let's not spend a ton of money on development. Let's not get car too carried away here. We just want to extract money from the consumer as fast as possible with as little, which as much profit margin as possible. So don't spend too much time on developing the game. That would be crazy. Oh, I got a helper, Electra, but not Electra. That's not her name, but inspired by Electra. Let's put it that way. Stands funny. <laughs> Hi, Electra, or whatever your name is in this game. Oh, wait a minute, can I pick up the mailbox? No, that would be. Oh, yes, I can. Look at me go. I guess I might have missed out on some of that in the first rounds. Standard beat em up fare, being able to pick up some of the scenery. This is very much a vanilla beat em up for the most part, with annoying transition lull, transitional levels. I just want to get through this section and see what's next on them. Or not, basically. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing with that. Am I supposed to catch that guy? That's the second time that's happened. Come on back, Blackie. Who's next? More? 
another. Oh, red and blue, blue this time, not, not black and blue. Wow. You bastards. Oh, no, he did me damage. Okay. Not sure what that's all about. Lissai. This is dull. Dull, 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 dull. I believe I've spent 20 minutes playing this already. ninjas, they're wacky. Um, I just got the music, the theme from the Tick animated show. Okay. Um, yeah. Oh, oh, who's that? Is that uh, the Defleeter Mouse, maybe? Not sure. However, I... Can I pause this? I've had enough! That is a game I cannot recommend that you play. Very vanilla. You know, it's it's meant to be... I think it's just a quick merchandising tie-in on the animated show. That's about it. So, um, it's going to do it for my look at the tick. For the Super Nintendo. I mean, the Super N system. Thank you so much for watching. You take good care of yourselves, and I shall see you next time. Bye for now.